try this side? No. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome to the Green Valley Parkinson's Support Group Exercise Class. Um, welcome to those of you joining us online on YouTube. Maybe your first time you'll need a chair without arms and a pair of light hand weights. A tennis ball, a larger ball, and some water. Class, well, it's about 45 minutes long. And we sit, we stand, we work on balance, we work on stretching, we work on strength training, and we have a little bit of cardio. So we you know, try to fit all that in in 45 minutes. We also need some room to do those things. So make sure Larry all of a sudden sat straight up. <laughs> make, <laughs> make sure that you are sit, seated toward the front of your chair. Um, yes, they have backs. We try not to use them too much. So make sure you have <coughs> some room. Yeah. All right. Okay. So with all of that being said, have a seat toward the front. With your feet flat on the floor, um, about as wide as your shoulders and hips, your hands on your thighs, we can start with breathing. So take a deep breath through the nose. And out slowly through the mouth. Again. Exhale. Bow the head. Raise it, relaxing your jaw, opening the mouth, looking up. Back to a neutral position to tilt the head. Both sides. Drop the chin, relax your shoulders, and now circle the head. The other way. Look down. Again, look up and stretch. And back to this neutral position. Turn just your head side to side. We're working on some flexibility here. And nod the head up and down. Back to this neutral position for some shoulder rolls. And then reverse the circle. So far, so good. Okay, good. Shoulder shrugs up and down as high as you can. Up by your ears. Okay. And then here, relaxing your shoulders, moving the fingers. As if you were the one playing the piano. <laughs> Stretch those fingers out, tapping each finger to the thumb. Elaine, scratch something. <laughs> Bob, make a fist and squeeze. And then a soft hand. Circle. One, One two, two, three, four, four five, five. Reverse five, it. Four, three, two, two one. one. We have clearance, so let's do some big circles. And change the direction. As we keep those arms reaching overhead, one at a time. One, one and, and two, two and, and three and four and one more. Five, and, and then come to the side. It's a flexed hand. Bring it in. One, out, two, two, three, four, and five. five. And then come to rest on the chair. One with a bent elbow and the other arm reaching overhead. Sure, you want to insert a yawn? Go ahead. And then to the other side, stretch it. Perfect. Cross the arms over your chest and twist the torso. Try to see what's behind you. Maybe someone. Hi, Michael. <laughs> Facing front again. Hands are here. This is a practice in where your weight is. We're going to shift it to one hip and lift the other one up. One. Up. It's not our most and attractive. Two. Two. And, and three, three and, and four and, and one more. Five. Mary, and take it into a march. Yeah. Think of this as just warming up. I have no idea what you've done this morning. Great job. And we come back to this position again. 
again, our feet are wide, the arms are dropped to the side, and yeah, if you need to use those chair legs, use them. Otherwise, it's here for some heel taps, out and in. That foot is flexed, two, two and, and three, three and four, and one more, five. five. And then heels up, toes up. Is that too loud? Is the music too loud? No? Okay. One up, one down. Good. And both flat on the floor. As you look forward, extend a leg. Lift that foot and draw a perfect one, circle. Two, two three, three, four. four Reverse five, that. Five, four, three, two, one. It comes back and the other one is straight out. And we're sitting tall in the chair. Of course. One, one two, two, three, four, five. five Five, the other way. Four, three, two, one. And we come back to this position. So if you need water, you should have some close by. Um, we're going to start. So reach down, locating the weights, starting with a very familiar one, a bicep curl. So sit tall in the chair. The focus is forward, but not down, about eye level. Raise them up. It's one, one two. two. Three. Use your outdoor Four, voice. Five. five yeah. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. And they come to rest. Stretching. Kind of stretching it out between those two sets of ten repetitions. We sit tall. Raise it up. It's one. one two, two. Yeah. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. And that's Ten. They are kept in your hands, but arms are dropped to the outside of the chair legs, rotating the shoulders and arms forward, pulling the shoulders back, stretching the chest. Yes. And back to this position, we lift one. Elbow is tucked, and it's a side stretch, trying to find the floor, but looking forward. Nice. And then we come up. That's also known as waste management. <laughs> Yeah, great job, and come up. We're gonna place one on the floor, out of the way. Keeping this one, wrapping both hands around it for an overhead extension. This drops gently to the back of the head and raise it one, up, one, two, two, good, three, three four, four, go Jack, five, five six, six, seven, seven eight, nine, nine, ten. ten. And again, we take that little break because it feels good and you want to stretch and maybe you could slip in a sip of water and then straight up to the back and raise it. One, One two, two, good, three, three four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And we'll put this one on the floor as well. Bringing our feet into a closed position compromises balance a bit. Bring them in, finding maybe a little deeper into the chair, but stay away from the back. The arms are crossed, straight out. Looking forward, lift them up, and it's flex One, and point. Two, two three, three, four, four good, five, five six, six, seven, eight, nine. nine. Keep them on the floor. The heels are together and the toes are out One, and in. Two, two three, four, four Reverse five, it, heels One. out. Two, good, three, four, five, and they come to rest. Separate the feet, uncross the arms, we come back into this position as we extend a leg. A straight leg and the foot maybe on the floor, sliding the hands down that leg, reaching from the hip, drop into the stretch and take a deep breath. And come up, beautiful. And then the other. Sliding down, past the knee, all the way down. Trying to work on some flexibility. If you can keep your foot on the floor, great. And come up. And again, that first leg extends, and so do the arms. And fingers <coughs> spread apart. As you twist, the opposite hand reaches for the foot. Looking down at the foot, this arm is reaching up for the ceiling with an open hand. Beautiful. And come up. 
And again, a twist and reach. Don't hold your breath, keep breathing, nice. And then they come down and the other leg extends. It's the same thing, it's opposite first. Looking down, breathe into that stretch. Nice, Nancy. And come up, one and two. All right, and there. And we sit tall and the arms drop and the feet come back into this position for some shoulder work. So we're just gonna grab one. Well, how hard could it be? <laughs> <laughs> so both hands on it, um, knuckles on top, and the starting position, Larry, is right in between those knees. Torso is tall. As you lift it, it's no higher than your chest. One and down. Good. Two. Two. Three. three yeah. Four, four. There's that little pause five, at the top. Six. six good. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. ten. Awesome. Take a break. Much needed, yes. And again, sit tall, holding it horizontally in between the knees. Raise it, one, one not too high, two, two, there you go. Three, three overachiever. Four, four <laughs> five, five, six, seven. seven. Can you feel this? Eight, yes. nine, nine ten. ten. Great job. So shoulders, tricep, bicep, core, so we're gonna put this on the floor. The third position for that lower body. Well, Mary, we need to be out a little bit more in the chair and open at the hip. Trying to keep your knees in line with your feet and the arms extended, it's that open hand. This will go on the inside tree right there, supporting straight above your shoulder with the other arm. As you twist, look up at your fingertips. And the other hand slides down the inside of the calf toward the floor. Clock arms. 12 and 6 become 3 and 9. Beautiful. The side, same thing, a twist. Reach for it. Reach out of the rib cage. Stretching. Good job. And then there. The arms drop down. Pivot on the heel, the ball of the foot. We close everything into that not so great position for balance. The arms crossed, a flat back, Lloyd. So you're gonna look over your knees and then the knees open and the weight is on the outside of the ankles. Yes. And come all the way up. And again, we transfer that weight over and there. Separating the feet, we're gonna do some seated lunging. So uncross your arms, bring your feet back to this position. And the three positions are here, and then here, and then here. So there's three of each, and um, they go pretty fast. <laughs> so sit tall, it's one, all the way up, lunging Two. into it. Good, Pat. Three. three. Now to the side. One. One, bring it right back. Two, Two. beautiful. Three. Three, to the front, straight leg and a One. flat back. That foot, it's flexed. Three. Three, the other side, lunging One. and come up. Nice Two. lane, don't hit anyone. Three, Three. to the side. One, One. bring it back. Two. Two. Two, Three. Three to the front. One. One. All the way up. Two. Two. Lifting those Three. arms up. Something sticky on the floor. Oh, it's grabbing me. So have some water if you need it. If you don't, we're going to take this position, Trudy, but we're going to turn to the side. We've got our feet in the same nice wide position, but the chair leg is in between them. The inside arm holds the frame. The outside arm and leg extend in opposite directions. Beautiful. Curl up into a ball. The arm and the leg come in and they reach out again. There's three ropes. We're going to grab them. Tuck the chin to the chest. One more reaching and curling. And then we turn just to see how they do over here. <laughs> 
No pressure. <laughs> so sit tall. Again, the chair leg in between. Inside hand holds it. Reaching, grab it. Nice, pull. Stretch it out again, reach. One straight line from fingertips to toe. And then another stretch. And then bring it right back in. And we come up, beautiful. We sit forward again. Our feet back to a starting position. Plenty of room behind you, yeah? The hands on the chair. Upper body is what this is working. So it's called a chair lift. The legs are there just for balance. So use everything you have from here up to lift you off the seat. Up, down, yeah, two. two. Three. Perfect. Four. Four. Just five, five more. <laughs> six, six. Seven. seven eight, eight. Nine. Ten. ten. And then we go from this good position to that not so easy one. It's a closed position. But we need to be forward in the chair. More space now behind you. Holding on. Leaning back slightly because we're going to bring the knees to the chest. It's one, up, one, down, two, two good, three, three, shout it out. Four, oh, yeah. Five, five six, six, seven, eight, nine, eight, nine ten. ten. Great job separating the feet. Again, stay hydrated. We're going to extend these out. This is that zipper all the way down midline. That's where they cross. Have more bruises than freckles now. <laughs> We're gonna sit tall. We're gonna extend the arms from the shoulder. The hands come together for some toe touches. Reaching forward, drop down one, one. all the way up. Two. 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 Beautiful. With each one a little further. Three. Three. And now put the other one on top. Same thing. We're gonna reach forward and down. One. one. Great job. Two. Two. Three. Three. That was good? Uh, sort of? Okay. <laughs> Uncross. Um, that just makes me want to say something. If you have um, um, an injury or you're recuperating from perhaps surgery or something, and you just want to make sure that you listen to your body, okay? So what you've been doing may not work for a little while, and so you want to just modify those a little bit. So work within your range. So we're going to take it wide, real wide, the knees in line with our toes. Sitting tall, the arms are out. These are heel taps to the back. One, One. all the way up. Two. Two. Stop in the center. Three. Three. Yes. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then we come all the way up. The arms drop, pivot back to a starting position right there. Yeah. Again, shoulders, hips, knees, and heels. The arms are out. You guessed it. Toe touches in the air. One, One and two, and, two and, and three, and go cat, four, and five, and yes, six, six we're almost there, and seven, and eight, and nine, and perfect, ten, and the arms, they and remain out there, sitting tall, the hands drop then flex those fingers Two, pulled apart three four, four just one more five. five stop and then open and close one, one two, two three four, four good five, five six, six get ready seven eight I don't know why. nine ten. <laughs> scratch something yeah uh, uh, and then make a claw and then Halloween is next week, so make your scary face. <laughs> okay, stop. <laughs> Relax, and it's out. The shoulders, they come off the ears, they're there. And it's palms up and down. One up, one down. Flip that pancake back and forth. Good. They're both down. They're both up, and they get tucked to the back as we pull these further. Yeah, nice. 
and relax. It's here. We're gonna fold at the elbow, placing one hand on the chest, but the focus is on this hand, sliding this one across the chest, down that arm, trying to match up your hands, then pull it out and unfold just to go do the same thing on this side. All the way down, yeah, fingers spread apart. Yes, good. Pull it out and unfold. Bend to the elbows like a big book that you want to close. And then stretch it. And then there, back to this position where it's out, palms up, shoulders relaxed, palms forward down and back, the rotation of the shoulder. Good, and just one resting softly on your head. Focus though is forward, gently pulling this a little closer to that shoulder. And same thing on this side. Nice, yeah, just soft music, I don't know. Nice music, so um, that was recess. Reach down and grab the weights. Recess from the weights, anyway. So we're gonna put them here, very close to the edge. The open hand is what keeps them there. So the thumb and four fingers are on that weight, looking forward, shifting the weight to one hip. This is gonna come up, extend it, bend it, place it down, and now the other side. Up, up out, out, in, in down. down. Two, out, out in, in, down. down. Up, uh, out, you in, wish. Down. <laughs> Three, Three out, in, in, down. Lift it up, uh, out, in, in down. down. Four, uh, out, good, in, keep going. Down. Up, uh, out, one more in, that looks like down. this. Five, uh, out, in, in down. down. Lift it uh, high, straighten uh, it, bend, in, and down. down. We're sitting forward in the chair. We're sitting tall in the seat as we extend one leg, and it's a straight leg. The eyes are off the floor. Lift it up for ten. One, one two, three, four, five, six. six Help me seven, count. Eight, nine. nine. Now flex ten, that foot. One, up, down, two, two. Jack's laughing. Three, four, <laughs> five, five, six, seven. 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 I would be too. Eight, nine, nine ten. ten. It comes back, and we shift to the other side. Looking forward, lift it. One. one Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Looking eight, forward. Nine, ten. ten. Toes up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And it comes right back to that starting position. We're so done with these. So put them on the floor underneath your chairs. And a tennis ball is what we need. So first time people think, a tennis ball. Yeah, we use this. Um, your balance begins, where does it begin? In your feet. <laughs> Trees like in your feet. Yes, that's right, at the bottom of your feet. So we use this little guy to warm up our hands as we think of posture, and also warm up your feet. So if you have shoes that come off quickly, take them off, yeah. And then stretch the fingers, taking that ball, working it in between. Yeah. I should, I'm probably the only one here that has stiff hands. So. <laughs> <laughs> so this is a good little guy to work that. A fist that's soft. Place it on top. Balance it there and extend the arm out from the shoulder, not down here, but here where you can see it. Track the ball. You're going to take the arm to the side directly out from the shoulder and bring it back. And then extend the other one, carefully pouring it or placing it in that fist and then taking that to the other shoulder. Nice job. And center. They're both out, and they're not real close together, but close enough that you can just place it. Good. And then on the floor. For those of you that took off <coughs> your shoes, stocking feet, bare feet, you're going to feel that. Push down as you roll. Yes, you little cute little red toe man. All right. I should have brought my other ball. <laughs> the spiky one. Yeah, the spiky one. <laughs> 
Stimulating, yes. Now try the other side. Don't just roll, but push down on it and roll. Do you feel that, Jack? It kind of hurts good. <laughs> You'll feel it, yes. <laughs> All right, so before it rolls off, please grab it, put it somewhere safe in the chair, maybe. And back into the seat where we get to use the back for support. Our feet, well, they're still wide, but they're slightly behind our knees, engaging the abdominal muscles, pressing into the back of the chair so you no longer have that space. Arch your back and then press into it. Again, arch your shoulder blade still on that chair as you tuck the tailbone underneath. Good. Looking forward, the legs extend and the feet lift. Circle one, two, three, four, five. The other way. Four, three, two, one. Good job. And they come back and they get pulled back. Peel off of that chair, shifting your weight from one hip to the other as you lift it and walk forward, giving yourself plenty of room back there. The arms extend, the hands Palms up, lean back. Yeah, you guessed it. This is all core work, particularly the abdominal muscles. Good. Sitting shoulders over hips. Three. Surprise, no one's counting. Four. Four. <laughs> Just five, five. more. Five. Oh, <laughs> Six. Six. I think of a trash compact. Seven. Seven. Eight. Eight. That's how my brain works. Nine. Nine. Okay, this is the one. Hold for ten. Six. Ten. Nine. Nine. Eight. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. two one. one. Great job. Come all the way up, placing the hands here. It's a flat back. You're going to shift your weight forward, over your thighs, over your knees, a flat back, looking down at the floor, lift a heel, lift the other heel, drop the first, the second, up, up, down, down, up, up, down, down, one more, just heels, up, down, up, down, up, down, you're still in this nose over toes position, the feet slightly behind the knees. We're going to come to a stand, <coughs> shifting the weight to the ball of the foot and come up. Beautiful. Nice job. And now bend the knees, placing the weight in the heel, putting that back side back into the chair. Nice. Shifting forward again and come up and back down. This is three, in case you are counting. I know y'all are counting, like we're not doing any more than five. Four. Four. <laughs> She's on to me already. <laughs> okay, one more, it's gotta be perfect. Oh yes. Now come down on eggshells. Don't plop. Crack. And there, good job. The fingers spread apart. They're resting on the side of the neck while the elbows extend. And this is a warm up for a seated crunch. So we're gonna twist, looking wall to wall. And then on this one, lift the knee to the opposite elbow. One, one. And, and good, two, two, shout it and out. Three, and four, and five, and six, keep going. And seven, you got and it. Catch your breath, and we need that large ball. I think it feels funny. <laughs> yes. <clears throat> so if you manage to scoot back into your chair, again, place yourselves forward in the seat, sitting tall, holding the ball, just with the palm of your hand. Placing that ball on your chest, the elbows are dropped. And now extend the arms out from the shoulder, focusing on the top of that ball. 
transfer your weight forward, reaching out as far as you can without falling off the chair. Put your head in between the arms and hold. Two, three, four, five. Lift just your head. Come up slowly, the arms still reaching forward. Tuck the chin to the chest as you pull away from the spine, reaching out with the arms. And then sit tall. The arms overhead, lean back slightly and hold. Beautiful. Again, sit tall, back to the starting position, not down here, but out from the shoulder, right in front of your eyes. As you twist, upper torso, go as far as you can and hold. Two, Two three, four, five. five. Excellent. To the other side, as far as you can go and hold. Two, Two three, four, five. five. Beautiful. We're facing front. We're going to place this in between your inner thigh, nowhere near the knees, but come forward in the chair so you have that space. The hands are on top. Judy knows, and your feet are together. Sitting tall, squeeze hard. One, two, three, as hard four, as you can. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Great job. Strengthening hips and ankles. Good work. We don't need this anymore, so. Wherever you want to put it, make sure it is not in our way. We're going to get out of the chair. And toward fall, you know, we start getting more people. Some of the snowbirds come back in. We have new people join us. Um, just make sure that whether you're at home or here, that what we've used or you've brought to class is not going to trip you or anyone else. Underneath the seat or on it is a good place. So nose over toes, come on up. Don't be in a hurry because we'll be to the back of the chair. Standing to the back of the chair, arms distance from it. With our feet again in that same nice wide position, either fingers here or arms dropped, we're gonna do some heel lifts up and down, lifting Two, heels. Three, three four, Five, great job. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Reverse that. Toes up, down. Two, three, great job. Four, five, wow. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I think I'm one of the few that can't do it without holding on. <laughs> so again, we come back to this position. Um, we're going to do some leg lifts. Might as well do the lateral leg lifts. So we've gone from this middle with our weight to one side. Soft knee, straight leg. And this one, about that high off the ground. It's out from the hip and down. Two, Two good. Three, three. It's the four, down that you want to control. Five, five six, six, good. Seven, eight, nine, ten. ten. Put it down, shift to the other side, eyes off the floor. One, One two, two, three. Where are you looking? Four, Four five, five, good. Six, six seven, eight, nine, eight, nine, ten. ten. And again, we come back to this position. Um, leg lifts still, but they're to the back. So. The weight will go back to that first leg. This is a straight leg, it's in a cast. So no bent knees, straight out. And it's one, one two, two, three, three I don't hear four, four, five, five, six. six. Use your seven, outdoor voice. Eight, eight, eight nine, nine, 10. Yeah. It's left back there as you bend the knee and we stretch the calf. Perfect, and we come up. Bring it forward, transfer the weight again behind you, and it's one, one two, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. ten. Bend and stretch it out. Perfect. Some kicks to the back. See, 
what's behind you or who's behind you. You've got room? Are you good? Okay, alternating legs. One, two, three, four, good. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I guess she's good up. Okay, far enough away? Okay, to the side of the chair, the body is on the same plane as the side of your chair, so you can use it if you need it, but the placement is on this inside leg, forward, without looking down. Let's try that again. Forward, right there. We feel the floor. Lift it up. It's one, one two, two, three, three good, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Ten. Ten. Bend the knee and One, it's up about hip height. Two, two three, three, four, five. five. And it comes back. Six. Whoops. You get extra credit. Yes. <laughs> we go to the other side. Again, our feet underneath our hips and we shift the weight to the inside leg, the hand here without looking down. It's extended and it's up. Kind of a two, relaxed foot. Three. <laughs> Four, five, six, six good. Seven, eight, nine, ten. ten. Bend the knee. One, up, down, two, two down, three. three. Yeah, on a string. Four, Four one more. Five. five. Great job. I'm a little cardio, but first we're going to do a little balance so we don't need any of this. <clears throat> to the back of the chair. There's a few positions that we all are very familiar with. And one is our feet right underneath us. Arms distance from the chair, so if you need it, it's there. Otherwise, the arms are dropped. And we're just standing. Soft knees, straight leg, core is pretty tight. Close your eyes. Open them, and if you need the chair, use it. Bring your feet together. Again, not locking the knees, but straight legs. Chin up, even though we're going to close your eyes. Open them. Separate your feet again. Cross your arms over your chest. Don't forget straight legs, soft knees, turning the head. You've got your eyes open, turn just the head. Don't look over your shoulder. Where are you looking? Eye level. And then to the other side, turning. And center with our arms still crossed, eyes open, bring it to a closed position. Be careful. If it doesn't feel good and doesn't feel safe, by all means, use the chair. Look up slightly and look straight down Good. and forward. As you uncross and separate the feet using the chair, just not, not like a death grip, but just there. <laughs> just, yeah, resting. So we're gonna shift the weight to the ball of the foot. The focus is forward. We're gonna lift the heels up on our tiptoes. Doesn't feel very safe, does it? Not no. so much. You may or may not want to just see what it feels like to drop one. Good. And bring it back down, placing both hands on the chair. Our feet now married together. All right. Focusing forward, shifting to the ball of the foot. Go up on your toes. Up for a challenge. Drop the other arm. That feels even worse, doesn't it? Yeah, very unstable. And place it back on and lower it down. Separate the feet again. Go back up on the ball of the foot. Keep your hands on the chair, your eyes open, but turn your head. Now to the other shoulder. Good job. Keep your feet in that position and come down. Bring them to a closed position. Forward facing, go up, heels up, hands on the chair, your eyes are open, so you can turn. Good, and to the other shoulder, perfect. 
and come back down and everyone can breathe. No. <laughs> yeah, it's an, balance is, um, it's a challenge for all of us, you know, but, and as we age, it doesn't matter, Parkinson's or not, practice it. So separate your feet, we, we have room. If you're here in class, we have room for some cardio, but before you leave the chair, make sure that you could walk around your chair and not step on anything or get tripped. Stay in motion. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, that you push yourself a little bit more. Um, you should be a bit winded when we finish. We're almost done, but we do need one more weight exercise. We only need one weight. Both hands on it, sitting forward in the chair, extending those arms overhead, reaching forward. It's a flat back. Weight drops. One. And all the up. way up. Oh, yeah. Two. Two. Up. Three. Up. up. Four. four. Up. Five. Up. Six. Up. Seven. Up. Eight. Up. Nine, up, ten, up, up, up. <laughs> All right. So sit again, straight up, feet on the floor, take a
a deep breath through the nose. And out slowly. Inhale. Exhale. One more. Exhale. Bow the head. Raise it and look up, relaxing the jaw. Your mouth open. Focus forward as you tilt the head. Both sides. Again from the center and down, looking down, sitting tall. Circle. Look all around. Good. Reverse the circle. Drop the chin, raise the head, look up. Last time, chin to the chest. Focus is forward, the shoulders to the front. Up as high as you can, to the shoulder blades together, good. And down, a big circle. And then the other way. Get excited, we're almost done. <laughs> Straight out. Palms up, they rest softly on the shoulders, the elbows maybe touch and open. Touch and open, good job. Again, touch, pull them back, and then bring them in a bit just to unfold. Place on the doorknob to turn that. Give yourself a big squeeze. Tuck the chin. Open the arms, stretch it. Place the other arm on top. Again, give yourself a squeeze and open. We end our class saying A E I O U Y to use our voice and our facial muscles. So if you're at home, join us. A E I O U. One more time. A E I O U. Thank you all for being here. It looks to be a beautiful weekend. And um, go out and make it a great day. Be happy and healthy and safe. And above all, be kind to each other. I'll see you again in a few days.